The House of Representatives has pledged uh, to amend the Federal Medical Centers Act 2002 by accelerating the passage of 16 bills to establish new federal ter tertiary health institutions across Nigeria. The Speaker, represented by Honorable Martin Zoke, assured stakeholders that the House is committed to creating laws for peace, progress, and good governance in Nigeria. The present 10th House of Representatives, at its inception in 2023, set out for itself a legislative agenda whose implementation would surely bring about tremendous improvement in the living standard of our citizenry. Today's hearing, no doubt, is in line with the agenda, and so also I expect the outcome. Distinguished stakeholders, I wish to urge you to freely express your views to opinions, either for or against the subjects of this hearing, in a manner that will bring about the sustenance of our collective of a collective will to be together as a nation. Amos Magaji, chairman of the House of Representatives Committee on Health Institutions, expressed concern over the significant challenge of health workers migrating to other countries for better opportunities. There has been an enormous migration of doctors, nurses, and other health workers in search of greener pasture in other countries, leaving Nigeria health sector severely understaffed. The need to reposition the healthcare sector to meet numerous emerging challenges is critical to its improvement. To succeed in this era, a system that is well invested on human resource and medical intelligence as the backrock of the healthcare sector is required. The establishment of the college will further boost economic activities of the area where it is cited. The migration of health workers and the epidemics and their emerging trends underscore the need for Nigeria to have enough and an efficient eco workforce that will be readily available when there are any health emergencies. This is the observation of the ministry and our position. The Federal Minister of Health has no objection to the establishment of the proposed federal tertiary health institutions. However, this should be based on merit. Government must pay serious attention to the, to the concept of PPP in running public health service uh, facilities as a way of improving funding and quality of care. Federal tertiary, federal tertiary institution shall be encouraged to, within the prescription of relevant extant law, operate PPP in provision of healthcare services and programs. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.